Hello, are you guys ready to read Days with Frog and Toad, chapter one? Chapter one is called Tomorrow. Toad woke up, drat, he said, this house is a mess. I have so much work to do. Frog looked through the window. Toad, you were right, said Frog, it is a mess. Toad pulled the covers over his head. I will do it tomorrow, said Toad. Today, I will take life easy. Frog came into the house. Toad, said Frog, your pants and jacket are lying on the floor. Tomorrow, said Toad under the covers. Your kitchen sink is full of dirty dishes, said Frog. Tomorrow, said Toad. There is dust on your chairs. Tomorrow, said Toad. Your windows need scrubbing, said Frog. Your plants need watering. Tomorrow, cried Toad. I will do it all tomorrow. Toad sat on the edge of his bed. Blah, said Toad. I feel down in the dumps. Why? asked Frog. I'm thinking about tomorrow, said Toad. I'm thinking about all of the many things that I will have to do. Yes, said Frog. Tomorrow will be a very hard day for you. But Frog, said Toad, if I pick up my pants and jacket now, then I will not have to pick them up tomorrow, will I? No, said Frog. You will not have to. Toad picked up his clothes and he put them in his closet. Frog, said Toad, if I wash my dishes right now, then I will not have to wash them tomorrow, will I? No, said Frog. You will not have to. Toad washed and dried his dishes. He put them in the cupboard. Frog, said Toad, if I dust my chairs and scrub my windows and water my plants right now, then I will not have to do it tomorrow, will I? No, said Frog, you will not have to do any of it. Toad dusted his chairs. Toad scrubbed his windows. He watered his plants. There, said Toad, now I feel better. I am not down in the dumps anymore. Why? asked Frog. Because I have done all that work, said Toad. Now I can save tomorrow for something that I really want to do. What is that? asked Frog. Tomorrow, said Toad. I can take life easy. Toad went back to bed. He pulled his covers over his head and fell asleep. Hope you enjoyed chapter one.